red street lamps, red mailboxes, red street signs. In Le Martinet, the color of Marxism is everywhere to be seen. And newcomers are quick to discover what makes the little village in the département of Gare so special. When I arrived here, I noticed they were all communists. I'm not a communist myself, but I'm very happy here anyway. The teachings of Karl Marx are on the decline worldwide. They often stand in reality for repression and injustice. Welcome to Le Martinet. Come on in. The communists won a staggering 93% of votes in local elections in this little village, while in France as a whole they barely managed 3%. In Le Martinet, we promote the values of French communists who fought against the Nazis and were executed. Coal miners founded the village a hundred years ago. André Bonnefoy and his wife Pierrette have always been staunch unionists and communists. One day an engineer came by and made a gesture like this, telling us, your work is worthless. So we said, if our work is worthless, then let's stop working. André Bonnefoy became the figurehead of the strike. The mine stayed open at first. This won the communist and unionist respect and votes. We were the working class, and we waged class struggle. But times have changed. All the local mines are closed. All that remains of the industrial past are the abandoned mine shaft trains. But Le Martinet has not given up its fighting spirit. The mayor doesn't shy away from conflict, and he's happy to take on the government to ensure his village's well-being. That sometimes means being proactive, like with the local post office. Sometimes you have to take things up a notch, like when a representative from the Postal Service once paid us a visit, saying we had to close our post office, and we shut ourselves in with her in the town hall all day, explaining why it had to stay open. And it is still open. But the mayor and his comrades aren't without their troubles either. They need younger generations to take up their political cause. Because here and in nearby villages, young people are drawn more to extreme right-wing ideas. It infuriates the mayor. The far right promotes simplistic ideas. They often say, immigrants are taking our jobs. That's wrong. And you can't base your policies on racism. It's unacceptable. For the mayor, however, the original ideals of communism haven't lost any of their appeal. They're visibly enshrined in Le Martinet's street names and might help win over the younger generation. Humanity is the guiding principle of our vision of society. And putting people first is also one of our party's values. We feel humanity is the foundation of a more just society with greater solidarity. Even if communism may have enjoyed less success elsewhere, the people of Le Martinet have shown time and again that they're not afraid to put up a fight.